Hello guys, it's me Alex Haycroft and today I have another video for you. It's more of a quality of life than anything for those of you who actually upload the mesh to Second Life. So you know when you upload and your viewer freezes because of the upload? I'm talking specifically about meshes that have skin weights on them or move with the body right and they're rigged. So I found a way to get it back to where it was, to where the skin weights aren't automatically activated when you upload the mesh. So let me show you guys uh, an example here of, uh, I currently have it disabled, but wait, set it back to how it is normally. Normally it's untrue for both of those. So we're gonna go and upload the mesh and you're gonna see that my viewer is going to freeze for a moment. As you can see, it's frozen right now. Nothing is moving. It's barely moving, right? Because of the high density of the mesh. You can see it's frozen. Gotta wait, gotta wait, gotta One eternity later. Gotta wait, gotta wait. And this process is somewhat time consuming depending on your computer. It can even crash your viewer and it's something none of us really wanted to be as a feature by default on. No one really asked for this, but yet here we have it. So if you start changing these values, your viewer is going to start freezing again. So let me show you. And it's frozen again and waiting, we're waiting, we're waiting. Two hours later. We're waiting some more. 5,000 years later, we're still waiting one eternity later more and there we have all our weights okay so this is this clearly you guys know that i don't make meshes like this so this is something a customer gave me but you know right so the way we fix this is uh we go here no we go to let's go from the start so control p from pipes and we go to advance in the viewer and then we turn on advanced menu right you don't really need the developer menu you just need the advanced menu mainly and then from advanced menu up here we're gonna go to show debug settings and over here we're gonna type weights and then we have fs mesh uploader automatically enabled and we're gonna turn this off and then we have the one under it mesh out mesh upload show weights whatever and then we're going to turn this to false as well so these two are going to be on uh, false right and now if we go to upload our mesh you're going to see that it's not going to freeze as much depending on your mesh but we can set these values without freezing right and then we can go here and turn this on to rigging and include skin weights like we did before the revolutionary update of the viewer we're waiting we're still waiting and our two hours later meshes has skin weights included and we can do the calculations to upload it and that's gonna make it um you know it's gonna make the process a whole lot faster than having to having this on when you set these two values to zero here or this one higher because this is just going to freeze your viewer every single time and do all the calculations over and over and over and over and over so this is something i figured out um, i tried asking in the firestorm group about it and one of the admins there said they had no idea about this so I decided to tinker around with the viewer and uh, see if I could fix this. And I managed to fix it. Well, disable it, more like it. Hey guys, Alex Craft here. I hope this video helped you. And if you liked it, please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. And if you have any issues, consider joining my Discord server as well. Thank you and see you guys next time.